Olivier, first day of running here, the roar before the 24, your fastest overall in the Michael Shank Racing Liger JSP2 Honda. Tell me about it. Well, obviously, the, the, the day went really well, you know. Uh, I don't think it's very relevant at the moment. Uh, it's still far, far away from the 24 hours. We just did our job, you know. We just did what uh, what uh, the team, uh, in terms of performance-wise and everything, you know, uh, what uh, they did uh, in, in the test in November. And uh, if you look at what they did also uh, last year uh, during during the race, uh, it's, uh, it's, uh, it's very, very similar. So we, ju we are just focused on, uh, on, on our own, you know, and and, um, and try to set up the car the best uh, as we could, you know, for, for, for the race. Tell me about this team. This is probably, I'm guessing, would be one of the most fun teams you'll ever drive for with Michael Shank, A.J. Allmendinger, who's crazy, Oz, Pew. I think there are probably going to be a lot of smiles, but also some speed. Yeah, no, for sure. Uh, obviously, at the moment, you know, the, the, the ambience in the team, you know, it, it's great. You know, uh, AJ, AJ is a very funny guy. Uh, I know was for, for some years now. Um, but it was my, my first day uh, inside the team and uh, they, they welcomed me uh, really well. Um, Michael is uh, is really uh, passionate, you know, and he, he wants to he wants to win. So, so I think uh, we have a target uh, this year. And uh, we'll try to, to push hard and, and to, to try to get the best result possible. So, Mr. Laura, when we were here in November, and if someone had asked me, do you think the uh, GTLM version of the uh, new BMW M6 was going to be fastest first day of the roar? I don't know if I would have predicted that. Tell me about how the day went, how the progress has been with this uh, converted GT3 car. Well, first of all, I have to say, we did a ton of work. I mean, back in Europe and here in the States, we're testing everybody in BMW. I know you've been around and you saw the increased number of white jackets and Munich support and also uh, increased people from RLL. And this is, you know, everybody's pushing so hard. There's so much effort going into, you know, both cars, the GTD or GT3 and GTLM. And According to your question, at the November test, if you would have bet me, I don't know, all year free dinner, if we are, <laughs> we are quickest here, I would bet against it. Um, but it's not about, you know, being quickest or being not. We, we just have to focus and we need to continue focusing on ourselves, on just our car, what we want from it, what we need to improve. I mean, there's still, a ton of work to do. We are by far not there where we say, okay, now we are there. But I think if you ask around the paddock, it's for everybody is the same because it's, you know, everybody has a new car. But so far the progress we've made is, is impressive and I'm, I'm very proud of everybody in BMW Motorsport and also Team RL. I, I didn't expect that to come that quick. Always scary when your first race of the year is 24 hours with a brand new car. So whether it's BMW, Ford, uh, the Ferrari turbos and such, I think reliability is going to be a question for a lot of manufacturers coming in for the uh, the 24 hour race. Is that something you can even put in the back of your mind, or you just go into the race thinking, hopefully we do well and learn a lot? Well, Daytona is also special. First of all, it's the longest night you have. And then you have a lot of full throttle percentage around the track. So this is very tough for every engine, every gearbox, every drivetrain in particular. Uh, did we do enough testing? You never know until you come to the race because you can test whatever, but then in the race you have marbles, you have dirt, and you know, there's all kinds of things you have to take in consideration. So until Today, if you say, oh, you are well enough prepared endurance-wise for a 24-hour race, personally, I think yes. If that is really the case at the end of the day, we find out at the end of the month. <laughs>